on that night, did you give your wife painkillers? For, for the injuries that she received from looking for your, for your son or daughter? Did you give her painkillers? Yes, because she was in pain. Gotcha. So we can believe maybe that she might have had the water too hot at the time, maybe. Is that correct? Maybe she just drank from that. So accusations of saying that somebody broke in your house right off the bat, no. you already knew that, that she was in trouble? Okay. One of those kind of things? How is it sustained? Because, sir, you're badgering my client on saying that because his wife screams, he has every right to believe that she is in danger, not because she is delirious or there's too much steam in the room. So the question really is, and I'll rephrase that, why didn't you kill her that day? So was it a premeditated or it wasn't? You had to meditate about it. So it wouldn't have been the first degree murder. It was self-control. So, Self-control. No further questions at this moment. Now, you keep on bringing up when he went into the apartment, but I believe the prosecution is when she died in his house. You keep bringing up the scene where she, he went and broke into her house, but yet there was no bleach board, as I said earlier. Now, if the scene of his house was not at the scene of hers. Why would you keep bringing it up? Did your wife shoot him? Shoot her? I apologize. Yes, sir, my wife did. In defense of me? Yes. And you, were, and you both were scared for your lives, is that true? Yes, sir. Now, John, either way you look at this, and at her house, there was no, the scene did not happen at her house. The scene was justified by her breaking in at his house with a weapon and trying to kill his wife and him because she did not, he did not accept her into her life. Now, do you, Your Honor, Jerry, do you all usually go in for mental evaluation on a daily basis or ever in that case? That you, you go into a mental, you go for a mental evaluation on a daily basis? No. Jerry? No. I don't think so. So, basically, mental, men, unstable mentality can become at any time. You can get angry and be unstable with your mentality. You can be jealous and be unstable with your mentality. Mr. Governor. Sir. At the beginning, when you first had sexual relations and you said... Okay, let's back it up so you can move on to closing argument. Okay, and you said, as quote-unquote, fuck off because she would rather have it that way. Did she not react in a violent manner? Yes, sir. I rest my case. Let's move on to closing argument.